SI93, I'm back with another video. Um, yeah, I, I, I was looking around for some new bo some boxing news and things like that, and uh, I saw Billy Joe Saunders. Sa Saunders? I, I, ca I can't remember how you pronounce his name, but yeah. Anyway, it's Billy Joe Saunders, I think. Yeah. He is now going around calling Golovkin a pussy. It's kind of kind of reminds me of Carl Frotch in the sense that both like before like before this fight and like Carl Frotch, especially when he was still fighting, saying avoid Golovkin like a plague. And this guy was saying in the Eubank press conference when he was fighting uh Chris Eubank and in the um before before the fight press conference he was saying Golovkin would beat me and you on the same night or something of that sort. Now after the Kelbrook fight where a lot of people feel like he got exposed. I thought he got exposed in the sense that his defense is kind of exposed to the world. And he looked a bit more human because now he's hittable. And if you pressure him enough. Um, especially on the very very inside or the far outside. You might be able to get a better off him. You know what? I do think Golovkin is a beatable fighter. A He's a very good beatable fighter and people some people think some people in my opinion is underestimating Golovkin Like the before the fight he was overestimated. He was overrated now. I think he's underrated Because now people think Golovkin is a walk in the park The thing is he hasn't fought that many good fighters, but looking at that fight Say he didn't fight Willie Monroe jr. Before if you looked at the, if a lot of people looked at the Kelbrook fight and they said he's exposed, now imagine a fight between Golovkin and Willie Monroe Jr. was being made. A lot of people would think like Golovkin would get beat. I think most people might if, might even think Golovkin will get beat. Like most boxing fans, that is, because because people see a fight people because people are dumb boxing fans are kind of dumb like Golovkin got exposed but he he's still a top fighter he's still a dangerous fighter it wasn't his best performance and I know it was a welterweight and everything but listen it wasn't one of his best performance and yet he broke the guy's face Billy Joe Sound was talking all this shit right now and I guess he's right to talk all like it's good that he's talking shit he's still in boxing unlike Carl Frost because Fox is kind of talking shit, be it in a more respectful manner, but he's, he was talking shit after retirement about Golovkin. Billy Joe Saunders talking shit while he's still in boxing. That fight could be made um, after the Jacobs, hopefully, and if, if the Canelo fight doesn't get made. I think Billy Joe Saunders will get whooped hard. Will get whooped hard. He, he's, he's a good fighter, but... Nah, man, he, he, he'll he get whooped, trust me. So yeah, I think a lot of fighters are now underestimating him and now what's going to happen is a lot of fighters will call him out and Golovkin will probably be able to get a lot of these fights at 160. So a lot of less people will duck him in, that, in the 160 division that is. And Golovkin will actually show them like, no, I'm still a top fighter. I think Golovkin is exposed, but he's still better than what people think he is. So that's kind of what I want to say. I think a lot of fighters are underestimating him. But yeah, I'll be back with some more videos soon. For now, I'm out.